Hi everyone, how are you doing? My name is Celeste Pario Siberiano and I'm here to teach you the routine that I've been using for the last decade in order to build speed with your bass drum pedal. And now let's go with exercise number one. So the first exercise that I wanted to explain is the 5K exercise. It is called that way because that's the minimum length of a race, right? And we are working on our feet, so that's important. We are going to start very slow. This is the most basic exercise on this course. We are going to do that by alternating singles between our right hand and our right foot. And we are going to be playing eighth notes and eighth note triplets. Our left hand is just going to be counting the time. So with all of that being said, let me please play this exercise at a very slow tempo and at a higher tempo so you can see how this will sound once you have practiced it. Let's go with it. Hey guys, before we get into the lesson, I just wanted to invite you personally to check out the new course that I have been filming with the guys at Dramio, the fastest way to get faster. There I'll show you my 10 favorite exercises that I have been using for most of my life in order to play very fast on the drums while staying relaxed. So please, you'll see the link somewhere on this page, but for now, let's go back with the lesson. Well, happy feet, why that name? Because here we are starting to play things that are a little bit more complicated. We are going to start playing fast right now. And that's because instead of playing eighth notes and eighth note triplets, we are moving forward and we are going to alternate eighth note triplets with 16th notes. Now, the concept is exactly the same. Our left hand is counting the time and our right hand is going to be alternating that sticking with the bass drum. So you are not going to have any kind of trouble understanding the exercise and you may just need a couple of minutes to get familiar with it. So now, let me please show you the demonstration for this exercise. Now, there is something missing, this exercise, the sprint. Why is it called that way? Because we are going to move from eighth notes to sixteenth notes and that definitely is going to feel like we're going from a jog to a sprint. So please, let me show you how this sounds. Okay, so now that we're done with the first three exercises, it's time for me to show you the fourth one. This one is called the marathon. Now, this exercise has like a pyramid scheme. We're moving from the eighth notes to the eighth note triplets, and then we're going to play the 16th notes, right? But now it's time to go back. So from the 16th notes, we are going to move to the eighth note triplets and then again to the eighth notes. It is a classic loop that we can use again and again and again to practice all of those three exercises together and have fun. But please, let me show you how this sounds first. Let's go with it.
So thank you all guys for watching. It's been an absolute pleasure teaching for all of you and I really hope to see you all very soon on the next videos. Stay safe and take care.